of Sholapur in Maharashtra, but I've lived in Bangalore ever since. Uh, I'm currently pursuing my bachelor's degree uh, in the Culinary Academy of India, Hyderabad. Uh, my hobbies or my pastimes include reading books, listening to music, and cycling. Yeah. What is your area of specialization? So I would like to specialize in the continental kitchen, the hot kitchen. Continental? Yes, sir. Yes. Can you name few dishes of continental? Yes, sir. So there would be pulea lakir, uh, there is a classical chicken, pulea swade marilyn, uh, pulea roti, uh, then pulea can you define the name pule? So, pule means chicken, sir. What does it mean? So, why it's called pule? Why not chicken? So, it's a friend. Three years old. <laughs> so, I <five> guess. <laughs> what is the life, lifetime of uh, chicken? Sir, I'm not sure, sir. About me. Not sure. No, sir. Yeah. When you say pule satay, what exactly you use the other ingredients? Sir? Pole saute. Saute. Mm. So there would be the accompaniments that go with the main course. There would be the starches, the vegetables and the sauce. So and the when you prepare it, what are the other ingredients you use in saute? Saute. That would be so oil, pepper, salt and a few herbs to finish it off. You? So there will be oil or butter while sauteing. Oil or butter? Yes, sir. Olive oil. Please. Okay. And then the pepper, the, uh, the seasonings, pepper, salt and uh, hopes to finish off with it. Okay. Anything else in the continental? So, no, sir. Continental. Tell me the best hotel in Hyderabad that I would like to go and have continental food. Best hotel, sir. Hotel. Uh, that would be the Trident, sir. Trident. Yes, sir. Trident. Continental. Yes, sir. Trident. The, the Goroi is known for the continental food. It's famous for continent. Yes, sir. Nice. Now, earlier I was asking somebody. He was saying some of the leftovers could be served. Can you name some dishes? The leftovers, sir? Yeah. I'm sorry, sir. Suppose I yeah. have some noodles left over. Okay. How do I redo that to sell it more? Noodles? Mm. In the continental field, you could uh, wrap them up into a tortilla. That has been done uh, during my industry training. The noodles were tossed, yeah. uh, given a, a, a twist of uh, barbecue sauce, and then it wrapped in tortillas and the pet given to the guests in the buffet, the Sunday brunch. Can you name a few American cheese? American cheese. Mm. Uh, so there is the mozzarella cheese. No? No, sir. No. Yes. So there's cheddar. Cheddar? From uh, America. America. No way. Cheshire. No. Beans. No. Evolving, not revolving, evolving. So, you can walk me there. Uh, I do not know. I haven't been in touch with the trends that are going on. I'm sorry. Alright. Um, you said your passion was reading books. Yes, sir. What kind of books? So, fiction. Can you name me some authors? So there's Iron Rand uh, that I did, uh, Fountainhead, one author that I did. Okay. I've read all the books, basically four books. The Atlas Shrugged, Fountainhead, the world, world as we know it. Do you do you keep an interest with anything to read the books that you read or you like of a particular author? Not all books in general, sir. There's very few books that I've read. Okay. So. Uh, I like reading books, but not all of this. I don't fancy them. If some, if a book, they are, you know, take.
Okay. Earlier one missed out on my question. I put you the same question. Yes, sir. Name four spiritual tourism destinations of India. So first would be Rishikesh, the the spiritual capital of India. Then be Varanasi. Then there will be Madurai, the capital, the temple city. And then there will be maybe. Uh, Rameshwaram. Or, okay. And what about your ambition? So my ambition, my ambition is to be an individual independent sir, down the line, to have a own restaurant of my own. That would be my ambition. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Steve. Thank you, sir. Uh, to introduce myself, I am Chalangi Mathur. I belong to the Pink City Jaipur. And uh, I have done my schooling in Delhi and now uh, currently pursuing my bachelor's degree in uh, catering technology and culinary arts in Hyderabad. I enjoy traveling, meeting new people, uh, getting to know about uh, food and that is what got me into the industry. The intricacies of food, how that one ingredient can change the dish, how it gives it that special flavor. That is what got me interested in cooking. Going by your statement, just tell us which is that one ingredient that gets disturbed in any dish, disturb people's salt. Wow, <laughs> very good. Okay. Uh, what is your specialization in? Uh, so I want to specialize in the continental department. Continental department. Okay. Can you give me the recipe of paneer butter masala? Yes, sir. Uh, paneer butter masala is a tomato and an onion based gravy. We first uh, brown our onions, add our tomatoes, then our dry spices that are turmeric, red chilli powder, dhania powder and in few cases even uh, zero powder that depends on the person's taste palate uh, we add uh, we can either we marinate our paneer and uh, then we add it to our uh, mas uh, masala that we have cooked our onion tomato masala tomatoes of course fine and you cook them nicely season with salt and garnish with korean Okay. Good afternoon, Shivangi. Good afternoon, sir. So you finished your vocational training at Jaipur Marriott? Yes, sir. You belong to Jaipur? Yes, sir. All right. So you know about the Rajasthani Thali, right? Yes, sir, I am aware. Huh? Yes, sir, I am aware about it. You are aware of it? Yes. Okay. So I won't ask you any questions on something that you are aware of. Okay. Can you tell me three destinations in Rajasthan other than Jaipur? Uh, Jaisalmer, Udaipur, Bikaner. Okay. Jodhpur also. Alright. Can you tell me what are they famous for? So Jaisalmer, the sand dunes, the Sonar Kila. In Jodhpur, we have the Mehrangarh Fort, the Umed Bhavan Palace. Okay. Uh, then uh, Udaipur, we have the lakes. Uh, and uh, Bikaner, in, again the fort. And the Bhujia of Bikaner is extremely famous. Alright, good. So what is the area where you want to specialize in Shivangi? So continental. Hot, uh, hot kitchen. Continental Hot Kitchen. What is gazpacho? Gazpacho is a cold soup. It's the international soup of Spain. Alright. I'll just go a little deeper into that. Can you tell me the ingredients? Uh, tomato juice, Tabasco sauce, bread, uh, cucumber, uh, capsicum. It's red in color? Yes, sir. 
Yes, Petro? Yes, sir. Yes, Petro, I'll ask you one bit. <laughs> okay. All right, if at all we were to take you into the hotel, uh, let's say that this was a realistic... <laughs>